Hello, in this video I want to cover um, frequent questions for people dealing with uh, 1D elements on top of 2D elements, uh, marine aerospace for instance, and would like to check um, if their 1D mesh or not of their 1D mesh uh, are properly attached to 2D mesh. So here purposely I did some random 1D mesh with nodes which um, from a graphical point of view, we see they are not connected. Some of them should be connected. So let me run the macro and then I will give just some highlights about it. So let me go to File, Load Script. I will pick my macro, Macros, HM. So the way it is designed, you need to select first the nodes of your 2D mesh. Sometimes you will see the messages here for my recording is does not appear so I will select them by component by collector to the mesh is this one validate and I will do the same for the 1D mesh okay validate once it is done make sure your idle mode on top is set to nodes and right click select retrieve selection and here you will have highlighted all the nodes of your 1D mesh which does not correspond to, or uh, which is not coincident with 2D mesh. So this one was, uh, some of these ones were expected, but these two ones we could have seen, so at first glance they were connected to the 2D mesh. Let's have a quick look at the macro, it's a very uh, simple one. So first I initialized a list, which is detached 1D, which will be the list of my uh, detached 1D nodes. I'm selecting with star create mark panel uh, the list of uh, elements from 2D elements, uh, doing the same for the list of 1D elements. And then I loop over uh, each 1D element of the 1D list. And with this command L search, I make sure that this 1D uh, node, it belongs to the 2D list. If not, so if the result is minus one, I append to detach 1D list the, the ID of this node. Once it is done, I create mark and nodes with the list of detached 1D. Uh, this is a frequent uh, point, but as soon as you want to populate a mark with a list, you need to precede it with Evalon. Otherwise, you will have just the first item beaten, taken into account. And then I have pushed uh, the mark to user mark so that from the graphic window, you can right click nodes retrieve selection. That's all for this video. Thanks everyone.